Today YouTube. This is my first video for my new styling channel. It's new styling is a gaming website slash forum which helps uh, inform gamers of latest gaming news such as hardware and software. Okay. But this is a video which is totally unrelated to gaming. In this video I just going to portray my skills in videos to help others learn about different technological skills first off this is a Motorola X4 64 gigs of ROM 4 gigs of ROM and this uh, is in need of OEM unlocking I also have a, a Motorola G7 Play which is a T-Mobile reveal The rebel is already unlocked and now this one also needs unlocking. In order to do so, on your computer you will need a few tools. Hold on. Okay. You will need EDB and in the description I'll be providing the links necessary for this process. You need EDB, the EDB drivers and you also need just basically to pay attention. Okay. You're gonna go to your settings of your phone. You scroll down to system and you also scroll down to about phone. You look for bill number and you continuously tap on it until it says you are now a developer. Now you're going to go back and you're going to go into developer options. There it is. Here you're going to enable OEM unlocking. Put your password if necessary. And you're also going to enable USB debugging, which is already enabled. Ensure that you have the appropriate and a working USB cable. I'm now going to plug in my Type-C USB cable into my phone. It's going to be a little bit difficult. Good. And on the computer, I'm going to run a few commands. Now, first off, you can just use your volume buttons and power button combination key to enter bootloader mode. I'm just going to use my computer, so I'm going to go to ADB devices to ensure that my device is there. And yes, it is. You go ADB reboot bootloader. And the phone is going to be now rebooting into bootloader mode. Here you can see that the phone is OEM locked. So, so now we're going to be continuing the process. You're going to be running the fastboot commands. So fastboot devices. And here we see that our device is connected via fastboot. Now you're going to fastboot OEM get unlock data we are going to be doing this process with um, underscores I can be providing the comments in the description now you're going to be opening notepad or any text editor a lightweight one is good you're going to right click on your command prompt just follow what I'm doing okay or just mark it with your mouse and see how you see to copy apparently the right click does not work paste it here so what you're then going to do you're going to remove everywhere you see the text bootloader and spaces 
so it's going to be combining the numbers with each other so as I did, did on the screen or as I'm doing on the screen just follow like that so I'm going to copy or highlight everything to here I'll continue highlighting then I drop my mouse and delete you'll figure it out just make it make a continuous straight line of that string that's how it is so I'm going to copy it we're going to go to the Motorola website and I'm going to put this link in the description also I'm going to sign in with Google It can show all the instructions. Now I'm going to be pasting where I just copied the while ago, which is this. Here, okay. it's going to check the eligibility of my device. I'm going to agree. I'm going to also request the unlock code. He said that if you bootload unlock it will um, avoid the warranty so now I'm going to go to my Google Mail to get this code that Motorola sent to me I had some instructions there but it was kind of irrelevant so there it is This is my code, I'm going to copy it. I have some instructions. So now we're going to be doing the fast boot OEM unlock and add your unique key. So we're going to do fast book OEM unlock and add my unique key. I pasted it. There, he said this is erase all user data, avoid the warranty. And paste it again for you to unlock now right now I have a lot of information on this phone this one my personal phone this here it's another my personal phone and the phone I am using to record right now is also a Motorola but this one already unlocked because this one was irrelevant at the time so by entering it by pressing enter it will erase everything I don't have to worry about the warranty because I, I don't have any warranty on this. The phone is going to erase and it's going to OEM unlock. After this, you'll be able to root your phone, install any firmware you like, whenever it's available for your device. So, this is basically it. So, thank you for watching and like and subscribe.